Hello, good evening. Welcome to our channel, Yushi Talks. And today we are talking about Liberate on Shark Tank. No deal, as Kevin O'Leary calls Liberate's desperate bitch cult. We have more details. Please continue to watch this video and also subscribe to our channel. Let's get started. If this pandemic has taught us anything, it has shown people how just important it is to focus and prioritize mental health. While mental health is now being spoken about more openly, Liberate is paving a whole new path. With a focus on mental health fitness, Liberate allows individuals to access classes and a community centered around mental health care. Liv Balder, the founder of Liberate, walked in hoping to back 200,000 for 10% equity. However, after her pitch, O'Leary's immediate question was, was she running a cult of sorts? Getting into numbers, she mentioned that retail class, uh, the classes retail at $19 and $49 per month with an average of 20 people turning up for these classes. The shops were not impressed with these numbers, to which she countered that most of her business came from corporate sector as they constituted nearly 6 uh, 65 percent of her sales she mentioned that liberate has made fifty thousand in sales till date now and she is looking for a corporate manager to scale her business but no matter how much she tried to sell herself the shocks weren't convinced uh with cuban saying that she needed to sell at a premium not out of desperation she even began uh, even began arguing with robert herjavec in the hope that uh, he, she can convince him. Finally, O'Leary was the last out of the lot to flat out reject her, saying that she should take her liberate behind a barn and shoot it as there was no scope for it to be successful. Fans were surprised and amused by Shark's blunt response. O'Leary even defended himself on Twitter, saying that it's nothing personal, but what I hate most is seeing time wasted. There's nothing wrong with moving on to the next idea. That could be your winner. However, before leaving, Liv noted that she would not be giving up on her dream anytime soon. Do you think Liv has what it takes to make it big? Were the shocks too harsh with her? Do let us know in the comment section. That's all for now. Continue to watch this space. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day ahead. Bye-bye.